is now activated. And Longhorn fever in the air in just days. Austin's going to turn burn orange local as the football team kicks off the first game of the season, and they're going to get a push from thousands of extra fans. Fox 7's Fody Kalurgis live on the UT campus tonight to explain. Hey, Fody. Hey, Mike. How's it going? And those fans will be seated in, a, in the new stands located just across from me in the north wing. In total, more than 94,000 screaming UT fans expected out this Saturday. It's a multi-million dollar expansion project that will put UT on the map for having one of the largest college football venues in the country. Looking around the UT campus, you get the sense something big is about to happen. Is this going to be nuts? It's a rowdy place. In just days, the Longhorns will once again take center field, kicking off their 2008 season with more than 14,000 extra fans in the stands. I'm really excited about the new stadium, though, that's for sure. Philip and his friend Jared hope they'll be seated this Saturday in the stadium's new $176 million North Wing. This is kind of a statement for the people that have bought tickets every year for 40 years. This afternoon, athletic director Delos Dodds gave Fox 7 a first look at the new addition. The North Wing includes 47 additional luxury suites, each one with a living room, granite countertops, and let's not forget an incredible view of the field. Workers still putting the finishing spit shine on the glass. I think it's, uh, just I mean, very if anything, it just looks awesome. I mean, even on the, the outside, just, just makes a very cool impression on the whole campus. The stadium is a money-making machine for the Longhorns. The university profits about $10 million a year from ticket sales and concessions, which makes upgrades possible. The North Wing also includes a food court and plenty of inside seating. And with all the extra bodies filling up the empty seats, well, get ready to plug up your ears, because it's going to get loud. The new addition is going to make, I mean, it's going to be twice as loud. It's Metro Rail Station. I think it's going to be harder to play in here. And UT announced today it has sold a record-breaking 83,000 season tickets. Tickets this year, uh, athletic say, director Dobbs also say, saying there is room to make the south and where we Decisions are to, to expand it to hold decision. more people. He's so hoping that will happen sometime soon, so stay tuned uh, to that. Now, the game here starts at 6 o'clock on Saturday, of course. Be ready for all the traffic and possibly the parking problems. Be sure you come early and park in your designated areas. Mike? Oh, yeah, especially the parking with all those extra people. Thanks very much, Fody.